Hey guys, it's Lem here again, your tech guide. And today's video, we are going to test out the Rinky Bessel styling under water. So I've read the description of this accessories and it looks like you could actually emerge it under water. So this is perfect for a situation such as if you are a diver, if you are the person who doesn't remove their watch when they go take their shower, of course, washing your hands. So we're gonna put this to, te to the test. We're gonna put this to the test and find out if this thing will actually stay on your active watch too. And just want to let you guys know that um, vessel styling that I'm using here, I've already been using on my other videos as a demonstration. So the double-sided tape on this accessories, it might not be as strong as if you have installed it for the very first time. So just keep that in mind that um, it won't be as good as the first brand new product so anyways we'll just test it out and see how it performs if it does perform from all those video demonstration that i have done already and it stays on the active watch 2 this will be a great product then all right so let's just make sure that this thing is completely dry so that it really sticks on to the watch i'm using a screen protector on this one here and if you really want to make sure that this thing will stick, get an alcohol swab and just swi um, swab it all around the screen display. It will definitely stick onto your watch. But since I need this as a demo, I need the vessel styling as a demo uh, demonstration for my other videos, I will not put any alcohol there whatsoever i'm just gonna press it hard and make sure that it's completely on the surface of the active watch 2 and we'll just go on from there all right and of course i've got the bowl of water over here and i've got my timer uh, the first test we're just gonna probably do a splash test here and see how it does Okay, so of course this thing's not going to fall off by just doing this. So I'm just trying to replicate if you are washing your hand under the sink and um, this thing's not going to come off. So what I'm going to do next, I'm just going to merge it under water, put my timer on and i will get back to you guys maybe i don't know we'll go for 15 minutes or five minutes first or we'll see how it goes okay guys so it's two minutes i know it's quite short but i just want to see how it's doing here i'm going to try to replicate as if you are swimming so i'm going to try to kind of splash it around underwater so that it really gets uh gets in there where the double-sided tape is and we'll see how it does okay just scrolling splashing okay let's check it out we're gonna nudge it here wiggle it it looks pretty solid intact i don't feel any movement that's gonna come off so that's pretty good that's a good sign sign right there but if i do try my best to pry it out it definitely will come off but if you just kind of check it out like this there's no movement whatsoever okay so we're just going to leave it on there it looks like it's pretty solid this will definitely handle some uh, showering action or your hand washing, do a uh, uh, this washing, hand washing of your plates. This will definitely handle it, no problem. It's for those serious um, swimmers or divers that we are um, really testing this uh, active uh, vessel watch, active two, to um, stay on the active watch two 
and hopefully it performs very well so that uh, it will encourage those uh, people to um, check this uh, product out. So let's leave it in there some more and um, let's restart. I forgot to turn off my time clock there. Silly me. All right, so we'll probably leave it there for five minutes or half an hour or so. All right, so it's half an hour now, 30 minutes. We're gonna check it out. Let's stop this. And let's see how the Bessel styling is performing. Oh, wow, guys, it is still stuck on the Active Watch 2. As you can see, I'm trying to wiggle it and kind of just um, push it out with my thumb here just to see if there's any slight movement, move, movement whatsoever. And I notice nothing at all, guys. Nothing. So this thing is pretty, pretty solid. It will definitely um, stick onto your watch. And again, like I said before, that this vessel styling is a demonstration. Um, I've been using this several times on my video, been uh, applying, removing, applying, removing. So I would expect that this would have been um, coming off on the watch already, but it seems like it is still stuck on the watch. So imagine if you got a brand new set of vessel styling for the very first time, you just place it on the watch. Imagine how long it will stay on your watch. But anyways, let's uh, just make it to one hour to confirm that this thing will definitely be there. Let me see here. And uh, we'll uh, go from there. Okay, so it's pretty much an hour now. Let's check it out and see how this thing is holding up. And uh, let's see here, let's wiggle this, if, pry it out, and it looks like it's still on the watch, guys. Look at that, it's still on the watch. This thing will definitely stay on your watch. It's not gonna come off whatsoever. And um, it is uh, safe to say that um, if you get a brand new bezel styling, it will definitely stick on your watch. Like again, this is a use vessel styling. And uh, as you can see, it is performing very well. And I bet you this thing can stay longer than an hour. But since, you know, we don't have that much time, I'm just gonna try to pry it out as hard as I can just to show you how much strength the double-sided tape has uh, left on its uh, life here. So let me try to pry it out as you can see. Oh, oh, there you go. So let me see again. So there's a little bit of resistance of force that you need to pull to give to remove it. So there you go. You have that some resistant left to um, move it from your watch. But just imagine having a brand new vessel styling and you have alcohol the surface of the screen display. This thing will definitely, definitely stay on your um, active watch too. So that's just a demonstration just to see how this thing performs under situation like this. If you're going to go for a swim or you're going to take it in the shower or just, you know, typically just washing the dishes or washes, washing your hands, you get splashes on your watch. This will definitely will last you and perform very well in those circumstances. So that's pretty much it, guys. Once again, thank you for watching my video. Until then, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.